Hey folks, I want to take a look at the beta version of After Effects and its new Rotol Scope tool. It's so much better, it really is. Here's a clip. Okay, and okay, there's After Lionel Bear. Effects. And I've just rotoscoped him, so his background is transparent there. Okay, and that's worked really nicely. Okay, and to get the new version, the beta version, if you go to your Creative Cloud app, and in beta apps there, you can download After Effects beta. Okay, so it's definitely, if you're going to be doing any rotoscoping, a much better version of the rotoscope tool. All right, so here we go. Here's the one without. After. Now let's go to the, let's double click to open the layer panel. Use the Roto Brush tool and I'm going to simply draw a quick, whee, quick outline here. Okay. And already, okay, that's almost perfect. All right, so we've got that. And all right, so I need to start playing through this. And just watching it to see how well it's doing. So I'm just going to hit the old space bar to play. There it goes. After effects. And Rotos. as you can see, it's moving about quite a lot. And previously, when I did this, I had to keep stopping it and fixing the ears. There's a lot of motion blur on the ears. Okay, and bits where it would lose the edges. But amazingly, Okay, despite all the fast movement, it's really sticking to those edges. Okay, so it's much faster and much better than the previous rotoscope tool. Okay, so I just stop that and go back to the composition panel. There it is. Okay, and I can take that and I can maybe just shift the edge in a little bit and then just add some more feather into the edges. And you know, you obviously, you can play about with this and but you know just in less than a minute there it's done an amazingly good job okay and i haven't even bothered doing any kind of edge refinement or anything so it's just a useful tip there if you're going to do any rotoscoping and presume this will be out in the next full version of after effects the next upgrade uh, but if you want to download the beta version from the cloud app and give it a go it's well worth doing so uh thanks for watching